Okay, so last time, if you remember, when the Nyaya no vertebrates and not invertebrates. And the Mokazaka to your loan lesson, which is about reproduction in animals. So, uh, Majamadaling Dorano, one of the characteristics of uh, animals is reproduction, when their ability to reproduce. No? And reproduce the momalet, it is the replacing of offsprings. When the How do they do this reproduction? Yeah, there are two ways sexual and asexual reproduction are uh, not just in animals but in different organisms. So animal animals are like the same thing, you know, we have two types of reproduction, asexual and sexual reproduction, malet no. So asexual reproduction. Malet, uh, no, and there needs to be only one parent. And the parent they have the genetic material of only one parent. So let's tell us how So there is a clone malet. No. It's basically a clone. Clone malet, aulam sale, and the nagar binor yezan nagar tamas asay. Kalle clone no mipalo. So a sexual reproduction is the same as this. We only need one parent of spring on chudamur are genetically can do parent gar tamas asay nacho. Simple yono animalu shleno. Common yono the asexual reproduction. The second type of reproduction is sexual reproduction. Uh, in this case, demo, we need two parents. Because the offspring would have the genetic material of the two parents. So it's genetically diverse. We have a colonial organism. It involves fertilization. Fertilization means it is the fusion of two gametes. We have two sex cells, probably the egg and the sperm cell. So deeply, and then that's all. Asexual and not sexual and might and shallow. So first, what's asexual reproduction? We're going to say it again. It is uh, involving one parent. It does not require the fusion of two gamete cells. In this like, the mandal no, and the parent has felgal, lila parent has felgal. So there's just one parent, kazaitanasa, lila offspring, mamta, tichlal, marathana. Commonly, invertebrate ushlain. Asexual reproduction, but I'm commonly honor. Backbone is not the same, invertebrate animal is not the same. It is identical to the organism. It is Types are So asexual reproduction and date now, how does it take place? Especially in animals, budding is the common one. Budding is just uh, through time and organism. It will form a bud. Bud is not they will start producing that. Another organism. This is the most common type of asexual production. The other is fragmentation. Fragmentation is body parts break off and regenerates into new animals. It's just there is no process just you own a body parts, it's going to fall off. Kaparan tulay, fall off yadar gal, and it's going to be developing into the new uh, offspring way mdamo, where the lich develop yadar gal marthna. The third one is partino genesis mandalono. As in yaw lay, I'm fertilized yonu egoch. Ah, uh, lam sale, he nyam invertebrates lay common now. Nagargan, it can be also seen in some vertebrates. Uh, unfertilized diona egg alla, ya unfertilized diona egg, whether adult women or the offspring uh, as an individual, si adeg malas no. Uh, insectus vertebrates. So, as an example, we have the insects in now, some vertebrates malas no. So, ahundamu, uh, whether sexual reproduction na manedo, sexual reproduction lay. Uh, it involves two parents, the fusion of two gamete cells. So let's see, it's going to be different than the parents because you have two parents, the genetic materials are used, and the other one is not the same. So this is sexual reproduction and the most common type in animals. Yeah, it's not common, 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 the sexual reproduction is but I'm common. So what do we mean by genetically kaparanto chu diverse hona legno minoro kale? Mendenau every uh, organism has number of chromosomes. 
ለምሳሌ እኛ ሰዎች 46 ክሮሞዞምስ አሉ 26 ከናታችን 26 ከአባታችን ይወሰድ ነው and it represented as 2n አንድ ሰው ያለው ክሮሞዞም በቁጥር 2n ነው የሚባለው so እንዴት ነው የሚሆነው ከfather cell n ይመጣል ከናትም cell n number of chromosomes ይመጣል haploid ማለት ነው so the male produces sperm cell ወይም n ብቻ the egg cells n ብቻ ስለዚህ ከሁለቱም ይመጣው አንድ ላይ ሲመጣ 2n ይሆናል so that's how diverse የሆነ ወይም ደግሞ ከናቱም ከአባቱም combined የሆነ organism ይፈጠረው ማለት ነው so uh, this is just a representation of how ka adult male and ka adult female a new offspring and its rise in the mother you know so imajemero zigar sperm cell alle this is actually a representation of the uh, human cell uh, in the process of fertilization so sperm cell has fertilized the egg cell which will uh, then undergo fertilization ka fertilization katlo mitosis nam inoran mitosis malet if you guys remember it's cell division now so a cell division it's going to bring ahun uh, egg cellu fertilized kona bohala ahun it's going to bring uh, a new yihona organism through series of steps malatna so etelayu stepoch allu ande egg fertilized kona bohala etelayu stepoch allu but before we see that fertilization men malatna fertilization malat it is the fusion of an egg cell na a sperm cell uh, generally gen not all fertilization is the same type we have two types internal and external internal fertilization malet it just happens in the female body malet no female body malet yaw uh, mostly happens in mammals and birds lemisale uh, like argizo mawled inde zaynet yemialfu bet process it is internal fertilization external fertilization lege it's different in that the female ande egun le kaderegech bohala outside of her body then that's when the male comes finds the eggs and fertilizes it malasna that is external fertilization it's common in some fishes and amphibians and we're going to see one of the example of the amphibians which is frog which undergoes external fertilization malasna so uh, now on the human cell fertilize katerarega bohala ከዛይጎት ያ ሴል ምንድነው የሚባለው ዛይጎት ነው የሚባለው ከዛይጎት ወደ ኢምብሪዮ እንዴት ነው የሚሄደው so the first step is cleavage cleavage ማለት it is መከፈል cleave, cleave, cleave ማለት መከፈል ነው cleavage is መከፈል ነው so አንዱ አይነበረችው የዛይጎት ሴል አንዱ አሴል ወደ ሁለት ስትከፈል it is known as the cleavage ማለት ነው so after that ሁለት ሆነ ከሁለት በኋላ ደግሞ በደም reproduce reproduce ያደርግና ስምንት ይሆናል ብላስቱላ ላይ ከስምንትም ደግሞ 16 ይሆንና ምን ይሰራል ቀዳዳ ያለው ባለ 16 ሴል የሆነ ሆሎ የሆነ ስትራክቸር ይኖራል ማለት ነው ስለዚህ ቀዳዳ ያለው ከ16 ሴሎች የተሰራ ከሆነ ብላስቱላ ሊቭል ላይ ደርሷል ማለት ነው አፍተር ዚስ ምንድነው የሚፈጠረው ይሄ ግሩፕ ኦፍ ሴልስ አንድ ላይ ይመጡና they are going to form three layers ሶስት ሌየር ይሰራሉ ይሄ process of forming three layers ምን ይባላል gastrulation ነው የሚባለው so እነዚህ ሶስቱ ሌየሮች ectoderm mesoderm እና endoderm ይባላሉ በአጠቃላይ ቦዲያችን ውስጥ ያለው ስትራክቸሮች በሙሉ ከነዚህ ሶስቱ ሌየሮች ነው የሚሰሩት ማለት ነው so ከዚ ከሆሎ ከነበረው ሴል ወደ ሶስት ሌየር የሆነ arrangement ይመጣሉ ይሄ ደግሞ ምን ይባላል ወደ gastrulation ነው ማለት ነው so ከዛ በኋላ gastrulation ከተፈጠረ በኋላ organogenesis ልክ ከስሙ እንደምታዩት ኦርጋኖ ማለት ኦርጋኖ ጄነሲስ ደሞ መፍጠር ነው ስለዚህ ከጋስትሩሌሽን ፕሮሰስ በኋላ የተለያዩ የሆኑ የቦዲያችን ኦርጋኖች they're going to be start ወይ ደሞ ፎርም መደረግ ይጀምራሉ ማለት ነው ፋይናል ریزالت ፉሊ ዴቨሎፕድ የሆነ ኤምብሪዮ ይኖራናል ኤምብሪዮ ማለት በአጠቃላይ የሰው የሰው ልጅ ወይ ደሞ የትኛው ኦርጋኒዝም uh in the uterine life lay yalle gen emiasfelgut organos bemulu ketemalu let bohala mede mibalo embryo no mibalo malatna so this is a representation of ka fertilization jemro eska gastrulation dress malatna so cleave ka derega bohala 
8 cell stage ከደረሰ በኋላ ድጋሚ ደሞ ወደ 18 ብላስቱላ ፎርም ያደርጋል ብላስቱላ ላይ ምንድነው ሆል ወይም ደሞ ሆሎ ሼፕ ቀዳዳ ይሰራል ማለት ነው አፍተር ዳት ወደ 3 ሌየርስ አሬንጅድ ይሆናል በሶስቱ ሌየር አሬንጅድ ሲሆን ደሞ ኢትስ ኮልድ ጋስትሩሌሽን ማለት ነው so now እያንዳንዱቸው የተለያዩ animals አሉ so there are different groups by groups ምን አይነት reproduction ነው የሚያካሂዱት የሚለውን ነው ምናየው so this is the first one is reproduction in insects so insects እን እንደምታስተዋውሷቸው they are invertebrates so invertebrates uh, ብዙ ጊዜ የሚያካሂዱት የ type of reproduction it's known as metamorphosis so metamorphosis ማለት it is a complete change and ነገር ሙሉ ለሙሉ ከተለወጠ we call it metamorphosis so there are two types complete እና incomplete እና ያቸዋል እነሱ so አሁን ደግሞ reproduction uh, in different groups of animals ነው ምናየው so the first ones are going to be insects insectoch they have a different type of uh, reproduction yeah before we start talking about how they reproduce insects እና ማናቸው የሚለው ለማየት so they are the largest arthropod groups ነው የሚለው so arthropod groups ማለት ማለት ነው they are phylum ነው arthropod የሚባል phylum አለ እዛው ውስጥ belong የሚያደርጉ ናቸው ይሄ ደግሞ የሆነ defining characteristics አላቸው arthropods የሚባሉት groupsዎች በአጠቃላይ they have segmented body አላቸው exoskeletons made up of chitin አላቸው legs አላቸው አብዛኛውን ጊዜ six legs ነው ያላቸው uh, wings አላቸው so these are the commonly defining characteristics of arthropods ማለት ነው so Uh, the common examples of insects flies grasshopper lice butterfly bikatalal yaw commonly mitaqwacho malet no and hey this is a picture of showing common yihonu insectoch uh, honey bi yallech bug uh, mm, abzanyoch tamasasayin atchu actually zeralt grasshopper lice nasu common insectoch nacho malet no Uh, normally insects they reproduce sexually neger gen ya insectoch web demo phylum arthropoda ust yallu animals reproduce yadergu there is a different phenomenon or word which is known as the metamorphosis metamorphosis malet i'm sure you have heard of it lower grades lay samtachu takallachu metamorphosis malet complete change malet no mulu lemulu mellawot an neger kenebarebet fully sillewot metamorphosis nam ibalo abzanyochu insectoch uh sexually asexual in behold they are going to be reproducing in the metamorphosis process malet no uh sexually kone yaw we know that there needs to be the fusion of two sex cells or gametes uh, so the males are going to be producing the sperm and the females are going to be producing the eggs malet no so uh and then they ከሜታሞርፎሲስ ለየት በሚሉ ኔታ they might use parthenogenesis if you remember parthenogenesis ምን ማለት ነው የሆነ ቦዲ ፓርታቸው ሲወድቅ ከዛ ቦዲ ፓርት ላይ ሌላ ኦርጋኒዝም ሊመጣ ይችላል this is asexual ማለት ነው asexually produce ሊያርግ ይችላሉ mating እና fertilization በኋላ አብዛኞቹ ኢንሴክቶች ልክ እንደ mammals by giving birth ሳይሆን by laying eggs ነው reproduce የሚያደርጉት ማለት ነው so now metamorphosis ቀደም እንዳልኳችሁ it's a complete change uh, how is it regulated ካለን insectsዎች ውስጥ በሚመረቱ different chemicals ማለት ነው so different chemicals metamorphosis ን control ወይም regulate ያደርጉታል and due to that no metamorphosis uh, happen የሚያደርገው there are two types of metamorphosis complete እና incomplete metamorphosis የሚባሉ አሉ so what's the difference between a complete and incomplete metamorphosis it's just the stage uh, ቀደም እንዳልኳችሁ there is it is a complete change አይደል መጀመሪያ ላይ አንድ insect egg ከ after they lay eggs ወይም ደግሞ እንቁላል ከጣሉ በኋላ አደል ስቴጅ ላይ ስኪደርሱ ከመፈልፈል እስከ አደል ስቴጅ ስኪደርሱ ድረስ there are series of stages complete ላይ ያለው የስቴጅ ብዛትና incomplete ላይ ያለው የስቴጅ ብዛት ይለያያል complete ላይ we have four stages while incomplete ላይ we have only three stages uh another more remember lemsale and stage lay yallo characteristics aw lemsale uh and sawlish ketewolede bohala lijim bihon adeltin bihon featureu tamasasayinu malatu and lij joro allo ayinallo afijallo likedetilikso 
the only difference is size no neger gen during this there might be yalneberu negeroch belejnes noro adel siyonu litaf ichilalu weyim demo lej iyalu yelele neger adel siyonu limatu ichilalu neger gen awon le complete and incomplete the difference mi yono mindinna is just the number of stages le complete ochu the first one yaw egg no ye egg stage alle the second one larval stage bi ipalalle ehenyaw it's a worm like በጣም የሚመገቡበት ስቴጅ ነው the larval stage የሚባለው so this is the most the complete metamorphosis ለሚያካሂዱ ኢንሴክቶች the most important የሚባለው stage ምንድነው larval stage ነው the third one is the pupa this is uh, inactive adult ወይም ደግሞ ገና ወደ አደልት ያልተቀየረ ወደ አደልት የቀረበ ኢንሴክት ነው ብዙ ጊዜ the fourth one of course adult ነው this is uh, the description of complete metamorphosis so four stages are there egg stage are there larval stage are there pupa and adult egg larva pupa adult this is how the complete metamorphosis is completed so complete metamorphosis can be carried out common uh, insectos makakel we have the honey bee butterfly beetle and so on so this is actually a life cycle of a honey bee malatu no zile bedem clearly tayal so we have the egg stage of the honey bee kaza the larval stage le yaw awon ezi gar yemitayawat larval stage na ezi gar yemitayut tamasasa yadellem which means you cannot guess ehenyaw honey bee no by just looking at the larval that's why we call this the, the metamorphosis so ka larval stage wede pupa pupa le they re starts resembling the adult አደልቱን መምሰል ይጀምራሉ ነገር ግን it doesn't mean fully completely አይመስሉም so this is a life cycle of honeybee the same goes for butterfly butterfly ዎቹ their wing የሌላቸው እንደዚህ አይነት caterpillar ነው የሚባሉት at the larval stage it's going to look like this worm ከዛ በኋላ ነው ወደ wing ወዳለው butterfly at adult stage የሚደርሱት ማለት ነው so the second type of metamorphosis incomplete metamorphosis ነው ቀደም እንዳልኳችሁ ሶስት ስቴጅ ብቻ ነው ያለው ሶ የትኛው ስቴጅ ነው የሌለው ነው ካለ ሁለተኛውና ሶስተኛው ስቴጅ አንድ ላይ merge ተደርገው ኦር ደሞ የሆነ ስቴፕ ዘልለው it's called the nymph so it looks like a small adult with no wings so nymph it's like the pupa but not also uh, the larvalum አይደለም so larvanum pupanum የማይመስል Uh, another stage no that's why we call it the nymph so incomplete metamorphosis le, we have the three stages we have the eggs the nymph na the adult malatno eh uh, enen kemiyakahidut demo the most common emibalo grasshopper no so the first one eggs alun eggs ochu ketefelefelu buhala heyo endemitayo they have resemblance of the adult ni meslalu neger gimen yellacho wing yellacho so actually grasshoppers generally they do not have wings kin they do not have some structures ka adultochu yellacho malatno so second stage name falle nymph no malat it doesn't have different stages malat sayhon it just doesn't resemble ye larva na ye pupan characteristic och that's why after different stages of the nymph at the end of the day adult honal malatno he grasshopper በዚህ ቪዲዮ ትምህርት እንዳገኛችሁ ተስፋ እናደርጋለን በቀጣይ ቪዲዮስ ከነገናኝ ድረስ 